Ed, welcome to uh, Bristol Rovers. You must be very pleased to uh, get the deal done, particularly so early as this summer. Yeah, it's, it's great to get it done. Um, I've been speaking about it for a little bit now, and um, I'm just really pleased to get it over the line and, and be here. Mm. And what, what were some of the key factors behind your decision to, to join the club? I met the, met the gaffer earlier in the week, and um, he's a very ambitious man, and I know the club's very ambitious, and and uh, I think the mix of the two will, could propel this, this club into the next division, and that's, that's the aim. So you obviously would have been in deep discussions with Dale. I mean, what, what were sort of the messages and the things that he sold to you to join the club? He just told me about the, the great group of lads that we got here and um, said the team spirit second to none and, and I know how far that can, that can take you. Mm. Um, and, and I know a few of the boys already, so um, I, I just can't wait to get going and meet everyone else. So does that help as well, coming to a new club, knowing some of the players that have already been here, if they're opponents or past teammates? I know you've played with Tony Craig at Millwall. So. I think it's massive, yeah. I think it helps a lot. Um, helps you settle in quickly enough and, mm. and uh, get used to the area. And, and uh, like I said, I'm looking forward to meeting the lads that I don't know. And you're no stranger to this sort of area of, of the country being a yeovil, but are you, you planning to relocate to Bristol? What, what do you know about the city? Yeah, we will do, yeah, 100%. Yeah. Um, my wife um, just had a, a little baby girl, so mm. um, we're looking to move the whole family over to, to Bristol and um, settle into the a way of life here, because, like you said, we know the area fairly well and, and uh, we, we used to love it, so mm. can't wait. Speaking of your time at yeovil as well, you enjoyed a, a good campaign in the, the championship. Is that a great experience you could... Look to bring you here, maybe next year looking to push for a playoff spot here at the club? I hope so, you know, that, that's uh, that's going to be my aim and that's the club's aim and, and the gaffer's aim and and uh, I think it's got everything here that, that it needs to, to make that push and it's just taking those steps and, and having the right people to do it. You obviously played here as, as an opposing player, is there anything that sticks out for you about the club, the atmosphere, anything like that? I, I know the atmosphere is always very good, uh, very lively set of fans and, and uh, I'm used to that, I've been played at Millwall a few times so uh, just like, like I said, I just cannot wait to get going. And I think your addition makes it five senior centre midfielders now at the, at the club. Is that a competition? The competition in, the, in that position, something that you relish? Yeah, I think as a footballer, um, competition brings out the best in you, mm. and um, it's just uh, it's just just the way that the modern game is, and you got to fight for your spot. And I'm I'm ready to do that. And for any fans that might not have seen too much of you play, how would you describe yourself as a midfielder? Um, getting on the ball, calm, collected. Um, passing and and uh, tenacity. Okay. Okay, thank you. Cheers. Thank you.